Right, so first of all, thank you all so much for 8,000 subscribers. It's actually insane to me that I've come this far, and I love all of you. Now let's get into the video. So today is going to be about my spoofer. You lot seem to love my unbanned videos. The two that I uploaded in the past are currently sitting at 65 and 200,000 views respectively. So I thought it was high past time to make another. And after my last two videos blew up, quite a few games actually watched them and implemented patches for that guide. However, I am still seeing the free guides working for quite a few people still, somehow, um, but also not working for most others, which is why I'm making this video. If you're banned and got some free time on your hands, you can check them out, try them. They might work for you. I've got them linked in the video description. But for those of you who have tried the guide and still got banned, or for those of you that just want a simple, one click solution, keep on watching. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is join either one of my discords. I've got my strip club, um, name's just a joke by the way, <laughs> with close to 5,000 members. And then my marketplace, um, which is sitting at close to 3,000 members, I believe. And there's a bunch of cheats being sold here. You can look at that as well. Uh, we've got accounts, just pretty much everything that you want, but you can also buy the woofer right here as well. It's called a woofer because on Discord, sometimes the word spoofer uh, flags. So woofer just means spoofer on Discord. And here's all the information. You can pause it um, if you'd like to view it all yourself or simply just join the Discord. So it's Windows 10 or 11. Here are the payment methods. Here are all the games that it's confirmed working in. If your game is not listed on here, it most likely works for it. I just can't list like every single game in existence. Um, got some more info right here. Here are all the motherboards that it works on. It tends to work on every single motherboard, so you should be fine. And then here we've got pricing. So a lot of you guys are going to be asking, especially, why can't you just provide a free software? And the reason for that is if I did, everybody would have it and it would be patched within two weeks and then nobody would be able to get unbanned. So I've priced it quite affordably. Um, if you can't afford this, I'm very sorry. <laughs> you can try to make a ticket. And for those of you who like are super broke, maybe we can work something out. I don't know. Yeah, so for three days, it's $20. A lot of you guys just want like one times or um, one day. Uh, basically, this was the original pricing for one day. Um, and then I just extended it to three days because if you need more time or just need more help, then it's just helpful to have those extra days. You don't feel so pressured. Um, and so this is for the temp woofer. If you want the permanent spoofer, just add on $10 to whatever price you want here. And so the difference between temp and permanent, temp, it resets your serials back to their original once you restart or shut down your computer. Whereas permanent, it lasts forever. So temp woofer is going to be for those of you who want to continue cheating, you might get banned a lot. It's just easier to have it as that. It's also for the people who have, let's say a lot of software that's like bound to their hardware ID and they can't just keep on changing it all the time. Permanent are for people who just want a one and done. You basically just run it one time and it'll last forever. You'll be unbanned forever, um, all that stuff. So to purchase, just make a ticket. Um, I'm pretty active on there. I've got a great support team. And here's the guide. You get it once you purchase, like here are all the customers. Um, here are the instructions. You've got cleaners. And now let's take a look at the software. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do after purchasing is make an account on the website. And this will actually be built into the spoofer software shortly. So check the guide to see if it's changed. And everything that I'm going through is outlined very clearly in the guide channel, which you get access to upon purchase. And if you have any questions, I'm very happy to answer them in your ticket. So on the website, you've got options to download, view the patch notes, view some stats, and most importantly, you have the option to reset your hardware ID yourself. And now let's check out the software. So after downloading, you'll have a zip folder, simply extract it and then open it up. Make sure to run the program in administrator and you'll get this cute little loading screen. And then after that, you'll be prompted to enter your credentials. And this is the same credentials that you entered upon making an account on the website. So I'm just gonna enter mine in very quickly and you can press login, you'll get a welcome message. And then here is the actual software. So you've got your history, total spoofs, successful spoofs, um, you've got some status options and then you've got your actual settings right here um, And in the top left you can just click this and you've got some more settings So you've got auto update so you don't have to keep on reinstalling the program You've got discord rpc run application on start You're gonna want to enable that if you have temp spoofer because you need to run the software Every time before you launch your game um, only with temp permanent just a one-time run 
and then beta mode, which you have access to some more features that um, are still being tested. So in the settings, you can enable permanent spoofer. This is the build that I have. Um, it'll just say temp spoofer if you have a temp build. So it gives you some options because I have the beta mode on. Um, so you've got permanent spoofer v2, which is still in beta. And I'm just gonna use the current one so I can press no. And then emo spoofing. So this stands for disk emulation. And it basically simulates a Windows um, reinstall without you actually having to do it. Um, I don't need that because I'm just demonstrating. But after you've got those enabled, you can just press start spoofer and this will pop up. And once the software is done spoofing, it'll simply just close out and you're ready to go. So yeah, if you have any questions, just join my Discord, make a ticket. That's going to be it for today. If you enjoyed, please leave a like and possibly consider subscribing. But yeah, see you next time. Adios.